Welcome back to another trucking video guys. Right now I am doing my pre-trip inspection. I do have my girlfriend with me. I'm gonna show her how to do the pre-trip. She's right there, so come on. Yeah, now go to the other one. Do they feel like solid? Like the que no yeah. que nos escuchen like um yeah. Más ganas, más ganas, más ganas, bro. Alright, now go to the other one. Yeah, it sounds good. I just wanted you to do it so you could take off all the dirt. Hey, girl! Are you liking the pre trip so far? Huh? Are you liking the pre trip so far? I like it, I'm letting all my anger out. What? Let's check the steering, these are the most important ones. That's good. Check what? Now you have to check your kingpin that nobody pulled out your la palanca. It doesn't look in. Yeah. Now you have to come under here. Go under there and see if it's. You have to see in there. If it's clip, you see the little clip going in there? Oh yeah. And it's like uh, across? Yeah, that it's means it's locked, clip. that nobody pulled it. Dressings, can I do ranch? Ranch? Yes. No problem. Mm -hmm. Do you want that instead of the Caesar? Since she did her pre-trip, guys, and she helped me out, this was her treat. Before I go back on the road for two more weeks. So, let's get back to trucking. We just filled up the semi with some diesel. I'm going to Bakersfield. It's a working load, so I don't know how long I'm gonna be there. Good thing I got my salad. I did eat partial of it. So right now, when we get there, guys, I'm gonna check in, and then I'm gonna clean my semi because it's not dirty, but it's kind of a mess. And I like to have my semi pretty clean. So when we get there, we're gonna clean it ASAP. Oh, 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 I got it, oh, I got it. Ooh, oh, the darn All right, we got it, uh, we got it right. be right here hopefully it's not packed because I gotta go to Yuma after this so let's see yeah there's some trucks already online because usually you go on the scale right here you go on the scale Right here you go on the scale and that's how you check in and then you park and you just wait for the call so I just hope is I get a door right away just checked in now they told me to wait for the call so now I gotta find a place to park but look at all this mud I don't know if I want to park here but I don't think there's no more parking over there I am going to have to park here. I'll just park here. So I don't know how long they're gonna take. So, let's eat some habit.
The ice melted. They just called me, they gave me door 38. So, door 30 is over there. I put these lights on. So those are, that's the box where they came. And that's where I put the old frame. back in this parking is easy because it's a lot of space we got door 38 so now back in and wait now the guy should be coming out anytime to disconnect my red hose and ask me how I want to be loaded right now I'm cleaning my semi on my spare time it's been about two hours and the light's still green. They haven't even started. So I just started cleaning my semi. Because you gotta keep your semi clean, you know? The environment you're in, that's how you, that's how you feel. If you're in a dirty environment, then you're gonna feel dirty. You keep everything clean, nice. And that's how you're gonna feel. And I've seen that, I feel like Every time I have my semi clean, I'm always in a really good attitude and a really good mood. I just feel way better. You gotta show that you love your job, you know? Show the passion. They just finished. what i'm gonna buy next so i could be like hello 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 10 4 10 4 any triggers out there this company you gotta park your truck and then walk up for the paperwork so let's go get our paperwork and then get on the scale the paperwork here's this beauty well remember on the video where i said i got my new semi well this is the first update to it i got the chrome led just the lights don't turn on yet i just mounted them but i just need to find somebody that can pass uh light to them let's go to the scale and head out to hit to Yuma so I got like six seven hours ahead of me so vamos I made uh, start my drive I bought some energy drinks because I do got a long uh, shift ahead of me and I'm gonna be in Yuma like around 3 a.m. 
Fun fact about my job, this is where Trevor's house is from Grand Theft Auto here in Southern City. There's this little little ranch called Desert Shores and his house is behind the trailer. That's where he lives, look. This is Desert Shores. You can barely see it. I wish I could I passed during the day. somewhere to park here in Yuma doing my logbook uh, it is currently 3 51 a.m. and I have to check in at 8 so yeah this is the life of trucking if you want to be a trucker no sleep energy drinks but it's all right time to hit the hay for real now I'm parking but there was a lot of parking good morning guys this is the next day just woke up to check in um, the good thing about my pickups is that they're both right next to each other across the street so that's one company that is across the street this is the other company I'm checking into both to see which one gets me in faster Just checked in. Now I'll go back to the semi and see who calls me first. Whoever calls me first is a lucky winner. <laughs> Cause that's where I'm gonna go park first. <laughs> Hopefully they don't call me when I'm like in a dock and then they call me like, oh come over here like dang. Cause at both companies I'm picking up like 12 or 11 pellets at both companies. So it might take a little bit while but I've never been to this one. I've been to Hippolito. That's where I'm coming right now. Where I'm, I just checked in Hippolito. They're pretty fast. So yeah. So I'm going to the second pickup across the street. They ended up calling me first. They said door four, so. That's pretty good. taco truck here but I gotta stay away from tacos although I love tacos I, I might go get some maybe not cooking my
my Malo Sopita. How many of you guys can see the smoke? Okay, it's here. Very clear. died so I had to go get a coke yes sir con un lighter ay ay es que no soy borracho bro ah, what the ah, finally first chug the scale guys it's super hot super hot I hope I'm not overweight because I forgot how to do this axle I don't know if it's axle by axle or just the whole truck nah it's the whole truck but yeah I hope I'm not overweight because if you guys saw my pallets are backed up all the way Are good on weight. I got 10, 740, 28, 600, 29, 800. We're good. So now let's head out, guys. Some guy slipped me off right now. I don't know. He just flipped me off. So I flipped him off. But I didn't have my camera. It's moments like that where I wish I had my camera so I could show you guys how people treat the truck drivers off. 